Hello, my name is Michael Helms, president of Light of the World Project. Let me introduce a good friend of mine, Jack Chick. Jack is the founder and president of Chick Publications, a company that has printed and distributed over half a billion tracks in over a hundred languages worldwide. I want Jack to tell you about a new film he's producing called The Light of the World. Hello, my name is Jack Chick. Back in 1943, during World War II, I was stationed in New Guinea. I was a 19-year-old soldier and I didn't have a clue who Jesus Christ was and I didn't care. Working around us were natives that we laughingly called gooks. I found them interesting to draw, but they meant absolutely nothing to me. After the war, I became a Christian on my honeymoon in 1948 and my life changed completely. I had a burden for the mission field, but the Lord somehow blocked me. He had other plans for me. In the 1960s, I saw a film about New Guinea called The Sky Above and the Mud Below. It showed villages of people with no written language, and I remembered those people who I joked about. The Holy Spirit really rebuked me. A burden hit me so hard, I fell on my knees and wept for those poor lost souls. I began praying for the people of New Guinea, and God gave me a love for them. He allowed me to create a wordless gospel. Out of the mouths of the people I drew came pictures instead of words, and it worked. The pictures in those gospel tracts really helped the people of New Guinea understand about Jesus. In 40 plus years, Chick Publications has printed over half a billion tracts and translated them into over 100 languages. But I've lain awake in bed at night so frustrated because I only had 22 pages in each track to try to bring the gospel to the world. I needed some other method to drive home the gospel message, to make clear the incredible blessing that awaits the saved and the terrible torment that awaits those who reject Jesus Christ. Something that would drive the gospel into their hearts. Something that would show them the truth about heaven and hell. Something that would show how Jesus was tortured and torn to shreds to wash away our sins. One day God sent a man to me who said I must do a soul winning film about Jesus. I prayed about it. The Lord showed me how it could be done with a series of paintings. And after years of work, we're privileged to present the Light of the World film. We've asked God to let it be translated into over 1,000 languages. And here's only a glimpse of what we've done. The main focus is to exalt the Lord Jesus Christ. We show that Jesus was the one who created the universe. We make sure the viewer knows that Satan is very real and how he works behind the scenes. We show the fall of mankind and how evil they became as a result of sin and how desperately we need a savior. They need to see how the Messiah was sent to us from heaven and how his life unfolded before us. We show his ministry and how he revealed to the world that he was the only way to heaven. And then the violent reaction to those words by the religious world and how Satan attacked through betrayal, physical abuse and torture, showing it as it truly was. We see the Lamb of God's sacrifice of the painful death he suffered on the cross for our sins. The light of the world shows the horrible price people will pay for rejecting Jesus as their Lord and Savior. But on the other hand, the unspeakable joy promised to those who receive Jesus as their Lord and Savior and obey his gospel. The viewer is left with no alternative. Either it's Jesus Christ or the lake of fire. Everyone must choose. Beloved, this film will be available in the summer of 2003. We want to translate it into over 1,000 languages to reach the lost. Pray for us and help us get this into all the world. The Light of the World, coming summer 2003.
Thank you for watching these clips from The Light of the World. Did you know there are 3.5 billion people in cultures that learn primarily by oral storytelling instead of reading and writing? This feature-length film presents chronological Bible stories in an oral format that will be culturally relevant all over the world. The narration, sound effects, and musical score are top quality. With God's help, this film will reach the majority of the world's 6 billion plus people. In addition to its powerful visual impact, the film will also be used on audio cassette, radio, TV, and the internet. A broad network of Christian organizations is rapidly developing to translate and distribute this film worldwide. This is a huge task, but the Bible says in Jeremiah, Behold, I am the Lord, the God of all flesh. Is there anything too hard for me? Will you commit to pray that God will use this film in every country of the world? Will you also prayerfully consider investing your finances to put the light of the world into over a thousand languages? $6,000 per language provides the written translation, narration, production, and administrative costs. Jesus said, I am the light of the world. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. Thank you for your time. Your prayers and your support are vital. Let's trust God together to use the light of the world to bring multitudes to salvation through Jesus Christ.